What is up, party people? It's your boy, Voltron. He's headed back to Sao Paulo. So um, there was a comment left below and it was by superstar viewer Miguel. And it's about XLM and Mercado. I'm not sure which Mercado he's talking about because there's two Mercados out here and they both have a large presence in Brazil. One is Mercado Libre which is like a, an eBay for Latin America. And the second one is Bitcoin Mercado, which is sort of like the Coinbase of South America. And so, but I'm guessing he, he's referring to Bitcoin Mercado because they, they had a little deal going on and they do have a major presence here. That game that I was at the other day on Sunday, um, there was a lot of advertisement by Bitcoin Mercado. So they have a big presence here and they are working with XLM, you know, and the idea there is that their partnership is um, to create some sort of coin that allows for international transactions, you know, because with them being like eBay, you know, there's going to be people buying from all over the globe. So they need a way to, you know, be able to make these transactions happen and they need some sort of stability. So they're probably going to create some sort of stable coin that's backed up by an actual fiat or security you know that's backed up by fiat so this way to kind of avoid all the shit oops pardon my my language avoid all the stuff that happened with luna and keep the government off their back but how does this tie in with with anchor whether it's mercado libre or bitcoin mercado and that's that they take picks. So we've talked about picks out here. Picks is pretty big. And you know, the fact that they take picks means the central bank is involved, which means Maxi Host is involved, because that means the telephone companies are involved. And then that means anchor inside. So there are connections there. You know, we may not see them overtly but Anchor is secretly inside. Anyway, guys, until next time, peace out and safe investing.